Today on MTG Unpacked, we're cracking more packs for patrons, and today the lucky patron is Bozza. And you can see he was very lucky indeed this month with his snap pack. I think he got a extra standard pack there, so got a crazy pull for him. And doing the pack blessings today, we have a Johnny. So we're cracking two packs of Dominaria, two packs of Conspiracy. Let's get the blessings out of the way. And the pack blessings are how we get the crazy pulls on this channel. All right, so let's do it like so. Good luck, sir. Thank you for being a patron. Crack into Dominaria here. And this is actually from a newer box, so there should be a lot of good possibilities left. We start off here with Ajani staring at the camera. <laughs> Get out of there. Charge. Fire Elemental. Relic Runner. And I've got the problem with the dry hands again. Grow from the ashes. Cards wanting to stick together. Divest! Watch out for this little fella. You may have an itchy head. And you might find there's somebody there removing jewels from your brain. It's quite unusual, quite a disturbing sensation. Just watch out. Academy Drake. Skittering Surveyor. Thalid Omnivore. Lanawar Elves. There's a nice pool. We'll set that one aside. Uncommons we have Memorial to Folly. Sorcerer's Wand. And the rare is Primeval's Glorious Rebirth. So this is a Legendary Sorcery for seven. You may cast the Legendary Sorcery only if you control a Legendary Creature or Planeswalker. And return all Legendary Permanent Cards from your graveyard to the battlefield. That's pretty cool. And a nice foil. Denitha Capuchin Paragon, Legendary Creature. And Whisper Blood Liturgist with a Forest and a Sapling Token. Alright, so Bozza will be getting the Rares, Mythics, Foils and anything over a buck. So let's arrange these like so. Moving right along to Conspiracy. And I'm going to say, I think Boz's envelope travels the furthest than any one of the patrons. It's got to go all the way down under to Australia, my former homeland. Alright, let's see how we do on the next pack. We have Marchesa's Emissary, Custody's Squire, Traveller's Cloak, Brimstone Volley, Power of Fire, Unhallowed Pact, Liliana's Spectre, Echoing Courage, Siphon Soul, Minamo Scroll Keeper, and Uncommons we have Unquestioned Authority, Flaring Flamekin, Fire Shrieker, and the rare is Edric, Spymaster of Trest. So this is a legendary creature, Elf Rogue, 2-2 two, two for 3 mana. Let's get a closer look there, there's a lot going on in that picture. Whenever a creature deals combat damage to one of your opponents, its controller may draw a card. Okay, so pop him over here. Secrets of Paradise is the conspiracy card with a construct token. Alright. Let's move on to Dominaria again. And which of these two sets is your favourite? Is it Dominaria or Conspiracy? I'm going to say a lot of people will probably go for Dominaria, but I may be wrong. Next pack we have Fervent Strike. And again with the cards wanting to stick together. Cold Water Snapper. Davenant Trapper. Skirt Prospector Creature Goblin 1-1 one, one for a single mountain, suck a goblin, add a mountain. Very cool to see the goblins here. Lanawar Envoy. Drudge Sentinel. Rescue. Blessed Light. Rampaging Cyclops. Aesir Glider. 
And uncommons we have Urza's Tome. Who was a fan of the Urza's block back in the day? Actually opened a bunch of those cards on the channel previously. I'll pop a link up to the playlist in the corner. You can check that out. Thalad Soothsayer. Whoa, and I guess, spoiler, rare is Precognition Field. So this is an enchantment for four. You may look at the top card of your library. You may do this at any time. You may cast the top card of your library if it's an instant or sorcery card. And for three, exile the top card of your library. Some cool artwork on that one. And we got a peek at this guy earlier, Ulgaros, the empty one. Another uncommon legendary creature with an island and a soldier token. Okay, final pack here. We're getting stuck into this cool conspiracy pack with the dragon on the cover. Maybe we'll pull a dragon. Let's see how we do. We have Brago's representative and Ajani. What is happening with the focus? I think he's been twiddling the knobs on the camera. Brago's representative, Reckless Scholar. Where am I putting these? Let's move them aside. Pillarfield Ox. Cinderwall. Vent Sentinel. Typhoid Rats! Creature Rat 1-1 one, one for a single swamp. We love the rats here on MTG Impact. Yes, we do. He has Death Touch. Very cool. Plummet. Infectious Horror! Respite. Valor Made Real. And the Uncommons we have Wakestone Gargoyle. That's pretty cool. I have not actually opened much conspiracy at all, so this is pretty cool. I like to look at the artwork on these. My Chaser's Infiltrator. Mokret Banshee and the rare is Ignition Team Creature Goblin Warrior 0047 mana. Very cool. I'm sort of jealous of this pull. Ignition Team enters the battlefield with X plus one plus one counters on it, where X is the number of tapped lands on the battlefield. Okay. So make sure you've got a lot of tapped lands when this dude comes out. Pay two in a mountain. Remove a plus one plus one counter from Ignition Team. Target land becomes a 4-4 four, four red elemental creature until end of turn. It's still a land. That is a pretty cool pull. And the conspiracy today is Sentinel Dispatch. So these are part of that special uh, conspiracy draft format they have. Leave a note in the comments if that's something you played back in the day. And a wolf token. Okay, so my picks today. Dig through. So we've got these. I'm going to have to go. I have not seen this card before. I'm going to have to pick the ignition team, right? Because it's got the goblin warriors here. Who else is a fan of the goblins? Leave a note in the comments. Okay, uncommons. So we've got a couple of choices there. Let's take a look at this red card here. So this is also from Conspiracy. We have Flaring Flamekin. Creature Elemental Warrior 2-2 two, two for 3 mana as long as Flaring Flamekin is enchanted. It gets plus 2 plus 2, has Trample and has Pay Mountain. Flaring Flamekin it gets plus 1 plus 0 until end of turn. Okay, so you've got an Enchanter and it gets extra abilities. That is pretty cool. So that's my pick in the Uncommon slot. And then in the Commons... Let's see here... Okay, we'll look at this other red card. You can tell I'm a fan of the red cards, can't you? This is Vent Sentinel. Creature Elemental 2-4 four for 4 mana. Has Defender. Focus, please. Pay 1 and a Mountain Tap. Vent Sentinel deals damage to target player equal to the number of creatures with Defender you control. And some pretty nice artwork on that one. 
All right, so leave a note in the comments if you agree or disagree with my picks, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings, and be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.